How is everybody today? Today is November 9th or 10th, uh, 2016, and this is this old block. It's the 9th. It's the 9th. <laughs> I just checked. Uh, today, well, if you live in America, it's the day after the election. And... Uh, some of you might not agree with the results, and some of you may, uh, but uh, the important thing to remember is if we stand together, uh, we'll be alright. We'll definitely be alright. We... Oh, no, that's not the right block. We need to stand together. Uh, we, we can't let hate bring us down. Because that's, that's how America ends. Uh, if if uh, we hate one of or each other because of who our president is, then we're not going to last very long. Uh, it's very important to uh, just just be yourself. Don't don't be an a hole. <laughs> Definitely do not be an a-hole. Uh, it's alright to be proud that you you wanted uh, the, the presidency to to go to Trump. Or it's alright that Hillary didn't win. It's it's alright. We're we're gonna make it through it. And hopefully, the promises made by the elected party will not come to fruition. Because that's the scary part. We definitely don't want uh, scared citizens. Scared citizens equals a bad time. Uh, it's it's like Sans is is running this this uh, year 2016. Uh, how how uh, how bad of a time do you want? <laughs> uh, as as long as we get our cold sp spaghetti, we'll, we'll be all right. <laughs> uh, and I mean, it could be worse. Uh, a few people who could possibly make worse uh, presidents. A T Rex. A T Rex would be an off president. Uh, 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 oh, the Emperor from Star Wars, horrible president, horrible president. Um, The the guy running against President Spud on DAMT. I don't think he'll make a good president. <laughs> uh, but seriously, as long as we stand together, we'll be all right. Now, if I'm being honest, I wasn't a fan of either of the popular candidates 
and they they probably should have chosen them a little better, but I guess history was made. We have our first Cheeto president. I hope he doesn't get cheese dust all over the White House, because that stuff is hard to get out of the white paint. <laughs> um, uh, enough talking politics. The, the build we're building right now is called the Jade Palace. Uh, I found it on Reddit by the user Noodles? Uh, I, I don't know if that's the correct name, but I'll, I'll look it up and I'll, I'll uh, put it on the screen and uh, I'll, <laughs> I'll show you a, a picture of what it's supposed to look like I'm just kind of guessing on what it looks like on the inside since, well, I don't have a picture of the inside. He just took a picture of the outside. Oh, no. Okay, dang it. We'll just put torches down here so if we ever do turn mob spawning back on, we'll, uh... We won't have any mobs down here. Uh, there, oh. Stairs. And final corner. And I guess center. There we go. No spot, er, no mobs spawning down there now. America, what's your perspective on the American election? Uh, I know, no, well, I was kind of disappointed with this year's candidates, as I already said, but uh, oh well, there's nothing much I can do. I uh, oh, that looks so dull. Total. Uh, oh, oh. We'll just run some, some wood across here. Come on. Now in the picture. I, I think it's just the 3D render that he uh, he made, so the blocks might be a little off. These are supposed to be one in, however, it wouldn't make sense uh, the way he had it. Uh, this is supposed to be one in also, but it's supposed to be touching that. Uh, so I'm kind of, kind of uh, ad libbing, I guess, for for this build. Uh, it looks like a really nice building. I hope it comes through once I finished it. But uh, oh yeah, while I'm thinking about it, I'm sorry I haven't really made a lot of these videos. Uh, recently, the the willingness to make the video uh, during this time of year seems to like plummet. Uh, and and I don't even know why. It's it's like oh, I've got to make a video. Okay, let me sit down and make a video. 
Oh look, a video. I'm gonna just watch this. Okay. Oh, oh, YouTube. Why, why, why give me another video that I might enjoy? Okay, I'll watch that one too. An another one, you do? What the heck? Okay, I'll watch that one too. And and it just goes on and on and on like that. So, hmm. I actually don't like that portion. That's that's. That's, uh, gonna be a second part. Is it like that? One more. I... Uh, and for some reason, I just can't... get out of the loop of procrastination. I'm... I am a big procrastinator. I... If it weren't for my mom keeping me on track in high school, I probably would have failed all my classes. <laughs> I, that being said, I knew the, the work. I knew I had to answer most of it. I just didn't want to do it. Which, uh, anybody who is a procrastinator should definitely listen to this. If you're in school and you procrastinate, don't. <laughs> You'll thank me later. Uh, get it done as soon as flipping possible. Uh, for a couple reasons. First one being, you won't forget the material. If you remember the material, you'll get better grades. I uh, also, if you don't procrastinate, you will be so much more happy. Uh, you you won't be dealing with the stress of getting behind and uh, uh, running out of uh, of. Uh, time do your work at that point it's just so flipping miserable and this this is first town account uh, my junior year that, that was my worst year uh, I, I procrastinated so flipping much and it, it just yeah, you, you get so far behind, and then, whoops, uh, I can't keep my grades because <laughs> I don't want to do this. Now, uh, also, when I was in high school, you know, it, it, same holds true for today. I have an issue with uh, redoing stuff, so I'm not the biggest fan of having to do things multiple times, especially math. Math, uh, when you gotta do it a hundred times, it does help. It really does. It, it pushes it into your, your skull, but it will <laughs> be so annoying. What is this? Uh, you, you, what? Interesting. Ah, get out of here. Um, if uh, if you just do it, then yeah, you're more than likely to remember all the the material and. Uh, you, you just feel better afterwards. Uh, of course, I never took this advice when I was in high school. I I was one of those kids who wouldn't really write multiple drafts of an essay. I would just turn them in as soon as I was done. Given I'm a 
fairly decent writer, and I am conscientious of uh, most mistakes I make. But, uh, you know, let me tell you this. I once turned in a column for my school newspaper uh, on the night of, uh, or on the, the day we had to submit the, the paper to the, the printers. Uh, I, I turned it in like an hour before we were supposed to do that. And uh, my teacher was just flabbergasted. He had never seen one, uh, an article with so few mistakes written in such a short amount of time. <laughs> I, I'm, I, I hate doing things multiple times. That's why I kind of stopped working on this at the moment, because <laughs> it's all repetition. Uh, I, I hate it. It's, it's so difficult for me to to do things multiple times. Uh, it, just just ask J.A. when he asks what, like, three times. If I have to repeat myself, I flip and lose it. I shouldn't, but I do. I just can't handle. I can't handle. <laughs> uh, so in school, if I had to redo something, I didn't. And even if I did redo it, it was because my mom forced me, which I'm grateful she did. Oh, man. man. Well, I, I say my mom, but both my parents did. Uh, my mom was just a little more strict. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I'm. I think I'm done preaching today. I <laughs> uh, just just do your your homework on a timely manner, and don't don't feel bad if the candidate you wanted didn't win the, the presidency. It's gonna be all right. I uh, it's it's definitely gonna be alright. Uh, I sure as heck won't let anything happen to you if if something does go awry. <laughs> uh, sorry this was a preachy episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you did go ahead and leave a like down below. Uh, it really does help my channel out quite a bit. I mean, you might as well subscribe while you're at it, too. Uh, I'll try to do more of these like I said I was going to in my schedule. That kind of has been hacked apart. <laughs> uh, I, I've... <sighs> This time of year, it's it's hectic, especially in retail, which I work retail. So, well, I, I'm I'm the manager of a retail environment, so it's gonna get a little more hectic towards the end of the year. Gonna be a little more tired and and all that. Uh, it, although the good news is the amount of videos that I've been releasing can't really dwindle too much, so. <laughs> Uh, it's only up from there, right? <laughs> uh, okay, well. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments below. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.